Hello everybody and welcome to some more Horizon Forbidden West. Last episode we got Aether and now we need to make our way back to Gaia. Uh, but first, Deca wants to chat. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Everybody's so needy. Where are you? Where are you? Oh, you're over there. I'm coming, I'm coming. There you are. There, Aloy, here. That? Let's talk. Is that the Congress? The visions throughout the grove are different now. And this one, it, it just appeared. Is this your doing? The visions have changed. That's the one that inspired Chief Hakaro. More testimony of the old ones. Hear now the words that reunited a people. Following the tragic events of the war, Anne Faraday, the chief architect of the reconciliation effort, addressed a nation in need of hope. If we look into the future, the lens of the recent past, our fears loom. Wars waged against machines, scarcity of food and water, storms that drive us from our homes. But true courage means facing those fears with conviction instead of cynicism. Leading the peacekeeping effort with these brave men and women, these marshals of the new Southwest, has strengthened my conviction that when we are united, we can overcome any threat. Join me. Join us in that conviction as we strive for a nation and a world without want, Reporting for duty, Commander. I'm coming with you. But Hikaru needs you. Because of you, he has new marshals. And a rallying cry the clans cannot ignore. So I will stand with you on your mission. Give whatever is left of my life. I'm gonna cry. Just Look, he I likes choose. us. We made a new How friend. Can I say no to that. So, there's someone who wants to join us. I need you to meet him in the foothills and guide him the rest of the way. We'll do, Aloy. Oh, I love that. Aside Go from to the all mountains, the west of Plain Song, crazy a friend of mine human machine you violence. That is good, wholesome content. I like that. I'll join you when I can. A friend of yours. Should be interesting. All right, I need to get Ether back to Gaia. Seems like All capturing right. it did something to the other holograms too. Let's head Might back to Gaia. Out. Thinking after Aether, maybe we go for Poseidon. I think that should be the next one. Uh, we'll have to see which one comes in order as far as love. Oh, cutscene. Oh, is our new friend going to be here? Like this? Oh, uh, you're not waving a hammer around, Aaron. Try a gentler touch. And my big sausage fingers don't really do gentle, okay? Bring it back. Trace the line. To your right. Other right. 
I just saw it. It's the one Aloy found up north. Gotcha. They call it a, a concussion beat party or something. Oh, my lord. Anna, that's music. <laughs> no, Aaron. No. Aloy. Aaron, you're all better. And you're here. Well, the world only goes on if you can do your thing. We learn fast enough, we help make that happen. You want all the backup you can get, right? We still have much training to do, of course. One does not become hunter in a day. Each seed grows at a pace of its own. Doesn't mean it won't bloom. You should know your Tanakh friend arrived. Katalo. I heard their warriors drink people's blood. I want to sleep with one eye open. I think he's seen enough blood for a lifetime. I showed him to one of the rooms. He seems to appreciate the privacy. Uh, looks like you've got things under control. I should get this to Gaia. Right. We'll keep on training. Catch up as fast as we can. I'm seeing glyphs in my dreams already. Well, while you've been off gallivanting around, I've been working with Gaia to find out more about the land gods. So from where I'm standing, you're in need of some training. Come along. Uh, Ooh, that's oh, that's like some uh, heavy flirting. Okay. All right, well, that was a little awkward, Aaron, Aloy. But uh, let's go chat with Gaia. There she is. Hello, mother. Welcome back, Aloy. When you're ready, please merge Ether with me. Afterwards, I must discuss an important matter with you. So, what did you want to discuss? While you were away, I received an unusual transmission on my dedicated Aluthia frequency. Aluthia? That's one of the sub-functions you couldn't detect before. Yes. The transmission occurred so slowly that at first it seemed like an accidental blip of data amongst background static. Once I noticed this irregularity, it took some time to collate the complete message. Coordinates. Where does it lead? To a mountain to the northwest of this facility. A word of caution, Aloy. It is possible this transmission is genuine. It is also possible it is being broadcast by someone or something else. You don't think it's actually Aluthia? I am uncertain. What's SOS? It is an old world code. A distress signal. A desperate plea for help. All right, well... I feel like you can go either Why way, right? Why would Aluthia send a coded transmission on a frequency only the two of you can communicate on? I believe it was done as a precaution to avoid detection. Or at least to create the appearance oh, or maybe of the desire it's to do not so. Luthia, maybe it's I'm also beta. uncertain why Eluthia would expect that I would be able to detect and respond to its distress signal at all. As far as it is aware, I no longer function. Okay, so either Eluthia is in trouble and sent the message hoping you were out there, or someone else is trying to get us to go to these coordinates pretending to be Eluthia. That is my conclusion as well. But then they would have to know that Eluthia wasn't able to be found though, right? You said the coordinates lead to a mountain to the northwest. What's there? I have no record of anything of note in that vicinity. Okay, and what about the other number in the message? 237. Any idea what that means? I have queried my available databases, but it does not appear to have any significance. 
Perhaps its meaning can only be understood at the indicated coordinates. Could the Zenus be sending the transmission? According to the data I reviewed on your focus, the Zeniths recovered the other Gaia root kernel in the Hades Proving Lab. It is feasible they used it to gain access to my internal frequencies. So, maybe they sent it thinking you'd respond and reveal your location. Possibly. However, the transmission is highly irregular. If they intended to provoke me into revealing myself, I would expect the communication to be more routine. Right. So maybe it's not them, then. But if it's not them, wouldn't the other Gaia still be able to detect it? All right. Maybe that's why it was I'll coded? I'll go to the coordinates and check out the source of the transmission. All by yourself? Ha! No way. I included Erend and Varl in this briefing via their focuses. I concur that you should not investigate this alone. What if it's a trap? Of course it could be a trap. But if it really is Eleuthia, then it's in trouble, and I need to bring it back. Don't worry. I'll be careful and... We're coming with you. <sighs> Fine. Go grab your things. We'll wait for you at the west exit, in case you need to upgrade your gear. All right, I think that we're actually good on upgrading our gear because I don't think it can be upgraded any further right now until we get more parts. So let's, uh, I think we should just head out, right? Yeah, I think so. Aloy, I was able to unlock another room in the main living area. Good to know. I'll check it out when I can. That was another right. one of those hey, fellas. There she is. You ready to head out? Oh, yes. Let's get going. Let's go. Look at us. Three battle-hardened badasses forging into the unknown. This ought to be good. Uh, this distress call had to be up a really steep mountain, huh? Oh, they already took us there. That's interesting. I was expecting to have to travel there ourselves. Oh. Maybe it's a new machine? Wait, did it go through their shield? Well, that takes the keg. Burl, see if there's anything over there? On it. We'll check out the battlefield. Let's start with that zenith. Yeah, that was weird. Obviously I thought there were zeniths than we know about. The shields were impenetrable. Can't believe you fought one of them. Almost didn't make it. Verbena. Whatever the rebels did, it took down her shield. But why was she here? I can access her last communication file, but I'll use my focus to scan the battlefield, too. Oh, what about that crazy weapon the Zenith had? I'm catching. It looked like she can make it come and go. It will. That's one of those new machines. But it's gone now. Yeah. 
Well, go do your thing. I'll wait here. The Spectre had instructions to assist recovery of the asset. I wonder what this asset is. How could it be with Thea? Is there something else? That's a Ravager. Investigate the battlefield. Yeah, I've not seen. It. Oh, wait. What's this? Oh, that's another cannon. Right? That's what he used to take down the shield. Now, this is a find. Nope. Not what we're looking for. Oh, it's something up there. Got it. Okay. Oh, there's multiple things over here. Okay. An Oseram with a focus. Looks like he was sending data on the weapons somewhere else. I hear voices. Ah! Ah. That weapon's still hot. I need to know how it worked. But I'll have to check on it once it's cooled off. All right, I feel like that's everything, isn't it? Yeah, because these are, that's the weapon. It's just a small catch. Oh, wait, wait, what's that? Another supply catch. It looks like there's still things to investigate. Oh, wait, what's up here? No, don't do that, Aloy. Right, well, nothing of importance up here. A rush of air. Am I not seeing something? You done looking around? Almost. I thought so. A dark gun. Those are catches or supplies. Do we need to talk to Val? What's that? Corpse. Wait, why is that one still lit up though? Oh wait, wait, no, something over here. Okay. Looks like the rebels camped here for a while. Are they watching this area? All right. I think I have an idea what happened here. I better get back to Errant. Where are you at? There you are, sir. All right, she who sees the unseen. What did you find out? This was a carefully planned attack. I found camping gear up there. The rebels must have been staking out this place for at least a few days. They were waiting for the Zeniths to show up. All so that they could test that weapon. The Zeniths have a personal shield that makes them invulnerable, but somehow the weapon got rid of it. The Osirum that was operating it was sending data on it somewhere else. It was probably just a prototype. I've known tinkers that do that. I'd do a little trial run before breaking out the real thing well, I guess it's still a work in progress if it blew up she was searching for something she had lost her drone had instructions to recover something called the asset the asset is that the uh, sub function thing that you said could be here the Luthia I'm not sure mom let's go talk to Val And he is over here in a cave, which I'm wondering if that means we're going to have to go in there. I think so. That's a long way down. Something tunneled straight down into the mountain. Looks recent. 
Boy, is that the machine that? Whatever it was, it must have been powerful. Radala was using when that she went Zenith to the chief. The rebels killed was looking for something called the asset. I don't know what it is, but my guess is it's somewhere down there. All right, so we head down. Erend, stay here and stand watch. That zenith isn't the only one of its kind. I don't want to be caught by surprise if the others show up. Contact us by focus if you see anything. Okay. If any trouble shows up, I'll call you. Let's go. You just go down? Oh, I guess so. I'm sorry. I thought this was like a up and down. There's some kind of old world ruin down here. You said the Zeniths have their own backup with Gaia, right? Yeah, from the Proving Lab. So maybe they were after Eleuthia, found its hiding spot, so it sent the distress signal. It's over here. Maybe. I guess maybe we just have to go this way. Maybe it'll take us back around. Looks like some kind of data center. I might be able to access the facility systems from that console. What is this? I've never seen a transmitter like this before. Looks like it's self-destructed. Well, it's definitely Zenith, right? This was a far Zenith research lab. It looks like a lot of data was beam cast from here recently. From that device nearby. So Eleuthia is gone? If it was ever here, then probably. Oh, that stinks. But then why oh. were the Zeniths still searching for so, the asset? So, exploring another far Zenith ruin. Wait, maybe... At least this one doesn't seem to have giant killer machines. Zenith is going to find Apollo, or anything you can blow up. Eleuthia, um, and there was another one. Not Hephaestus. I forget what the other missing was. But maybe then there'll be two guys, and then we'll have to combine both guys together? Also, where is this thing? Not really telling me to go anywhere, just to explore. I don't know how I feel about that. Can this break? No. What's in here? Oh, I see something purple. All this stuff. I wonder what they were doing here. Well, find anything that might Zenith. tell us what the asset is. Probably discovering a maze. I don't think so. All right, so not in here. So just somehow gonna find this thing. Oh, what's over here? Maybe up. This is huge. Some yeah, kind of storage room, maybe. Maybe the asset is in here somewhere. If it is, somehow the Zenith couldn't find it. Let's look around. Well, so, so, um, how is Aaron taking all of this? Really? Well, Gaia, the Zenith, the Focus, it's a lot. But when I caught up to him in the daunt and said you needed our help, he dropped Punker everything door? and turned around. Maybe? Oh, well, he's loyal. That's for sure. Uh, packs full, but my stash has room. Oh, there's so many stashes in here. Hold on. Alright, there's a bunker door over here. The control oh, console to access the storage units. Can it tell us if the asset is in one of them? Oh, well, let's find out. Oh, the code from the 236 message. 236 containers in storage. Please enter the container number you'd like to retrieve. 236? Wasn't there a number in the distress signal? You're right. Wait, I thought it was 237. I Just 
So if there's 236 containers, that means whatever is in 237 has to be the asset. Oh my god, it's a person. Oh my god, is it Elizabeth? Oh, it's Beta! Wait a minute. No. Are they all clones? Aloy. It's you. Like 237 clones of Elizabeth Sobek? Skins like ice. Must have cut this from her head. But why? No. Oh. Elizabeth. Uh, apologies, I don't know what else to call you. Um, my name is Beta. I'm afraid I, I must be brief. I only have a few minutes before my keepers discover I'm missing, and I still need to remove this implant. I had hoped to find shelter with you, but if you're viewing this, I, I may be dead. Be careful when you take on Farsiness. They are ruthless, and they have Aluthia, Artemis, and Apollo now. But at least I don't have the diet kernel to march them with. Oh, where is it? Oh. So that was you the asset. You must succeed. Oh, this was all for nothing. Good luck. And goodbye. I was really hoping Aloy would find so her sister. She's still alive. What? We need to get her back to- You couldn't leave with that ball? Oh yeah. shit, they can fly. <laughs> Aloy. Aloy, can, can you hear me through this thing? What's going on, Aaron? Two of those spectral things just fell out of the sky. One of them is heading down towards you. The other one's waiting up here. We're coming up. Stay in cover until I get there. You got it. Get her to cover in that room. Whatever happens, she stays with us. I'll protect her. Oh. Yo, I'm gonna cry. I All should right. prepare before the Spectre gets here. Yeah, you should. I'm not I can't let it get through to Varl on the clone. So maybe we should lay down traps. Is that what you're saying? Any more would be overkill. Here it comes! Oh, I wasn't ready. Oh, it's got. Ooh, oh. ugly one, aren't you? All right. Um, let's see, acid. Come on, buddy. Oh, you. I do creepy stuff. Okay. I should Come on. That thing. See if it has any weak spots. We did skin it. That thing's quick. All right. Come on, you can do this. Give me shots left. Oh. Oh. Come on. Yeah, that's right. You mad? Come on. Uh, let's see, how about electric? We haven't used that yet. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, oh you're a jerk. I don't like you one bit. No, get out of the way, get out of the way. Come on, set off these. Oh, wait, what's. Oh! Son of a. Right, you know what? No more playing Mr. Nice Guy. Come on. Yeah, that's right, come on. Aloy, what are you doing? Alright. What is this? Go ahead, bud. What are you doing? Goodbye. Jeez Louise. There. Are you okay, Aloy? Yeah, I'm heading up top. Stay you down here with the cloak for now. All. 
Got it. I'll follow once the coast is clear. All right. Oh wait, what's this? Can How do you like me now? With a cannon? I don't think we can. We gotta go. Yeah, we gotta travel quite a bit. All right. So let's go rescue Aaron. That was a hard battle. I wonder if we're gonna have to do like a big fight like against the swarm of them. Gotta get back up top and deal with that. I feel like specter. they're gonna converge against the base. I just hope Aaron stays in cover. Us too. Also, I gotta remember how to get out of here. Alright, let's triple up on arrows. Poison. Hey, Lloyd. Ah. Errand. Yeah, the Spectre's dug its seals in. It's got me pinned down. I'm coming, bud. I'm coming. Hang tight. I'm almost there. Just hey, hurry. hurry. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm gonna go this way, right? All right. Now we're. Oh wait. Where's the hole? Think this is yeah okay here we go hopefully it's just one of the specters i gotta get to Aaron. Aaron, i'm here Ooh, right. watch out that thing shooting down the center stay put i'll see what i can do shields down the second you need me it's on the move there all right. Oh, look at that thing fizzing away. Come on, bud. I got gotcha. you. Now this is why I can't get on. Pick it up. Need it. Hey, Loy, did you hit this thing with acid? Oh, okay, so you want acid then. Hey, Loy, oh, get out Jesus. of there. I'm good, I'm good. I'm good. You said acid then. Weak spot. Yeah, that's right. You're going down to your robot squid. New weapon? There she is. Hey, Lloyd. She's... Look, I swear I'm not drunk, but... Right now, I'm seeing double. Long story, but it'll have to wait. She needs a healer, but we need to get her back to the base immediately. Right. Yeah. Well, what are we waiting for then? Oh, wait, 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 wait. Uh, you two, I... go on ahead. I need to take another look at that weapon. Okay, good. Ooh, that's you, Gwenny. Little puppy sneezes. I can All figure right. out how that thing works. Maybe yeah, Zenith won't be so invincible after all. Wait, did the oh, machine just disappear? Wait a minute. Where'd it go? Maybe we're here? Oh, there you are. Alright, where's your weapon? Is that it right there? Oh, this weapon over here. Wait a minute, I thought we were looking at something else though. Hold on. Yeah, I could have swore we were looking at something else. Yeah, there's a rabbit though. Hold on. Oh, it's only white. Alright. Alright, let's get to this weapon. I'm 
no. Oh, damn it. Wait, what is that? Is that a power oh, cell? It's better than nothing. I need to get the weapon fragment to Gaia to analyze. I think it just took us right it, here. Okay. Maybe we'll have a way to defeat the Zeniths. I should check on the clone, too. Burl, where's our guest? We're in the maintenance corridor below the control room. Right here. Aloy. Glad you made it back okay. She panicked after waking up and stumbled down here. I thought it best to wait for you. I'll talk to her. Hello? It's, uh, it's Beta, right? My name's Aloy. What's wrong? Is it your injury? Simulacrum withdrawal syndrome. I don't understand. Sudden removal of a neurologically integrated data device. The brain, especially the cerebellum, goes into a kind of sensory freefall. Everything real feels unreal, distant. Is there anything that can help? Do you have a focus to spare? It's, it's primitive, but I can make it work. Yeah. Booting up. Oh, hopefully she's not a machine. And this isn't so, like some weird sick joke wait, by the Zenith. I suppose you want information. About you and the Zeniths? Yeah. Why are they here? What do they want? How do they get you? But let's start at the beginning. I'm guessing they faked the destruction of their ship a thousand years ago? That seems consistent with their behavior. They wouldn't want to be followed. So far, Zenith established a colony world after all. Yes, for a few hundred years, but it didn't last. Some sort of natural disaster rendered it uninhabitable. Okay, so... The descendants of Far Zenith escaped a dying planet, and now they want to claim Earth for themselves? Not their descendants. What? Not their descendants. It, it, it's them. What? The same ones who left Earth a thousand years ago. You didn't know? How is that possible? How can they still be alive? They don't even look... What do they do to themselves? I believe it's a combination of pharmaceutical, cellular treatments, and technological implants. And, and you? Does that mean that you are... I'm not like them. I was made. On the way to Earth. On the ship. I spent years studying in my training interface. Also that I could serve my function. Access and control of the terraforming system. But why? What do the Zeniths want with it? When I discovered the Zero Dawn system had disseminated into its subcomponents, I thought my purpose was to fix it. But I don't think the Zeniths want that at all. I think they want to wipe Earth clean and start over. All right, lots of questions here. So the Zeniths want to exterminate life on Earth. That's what Guy and I concluded too. But why? Why kill everyone just to take over? When they took me on missions with them, I saw how they butchered the tribal people we encountered. They didn't seem to care about a rejuvenated Earth, so I concluded that they must want a hard reboot of the system. Then they can redesign it to be exactly what they want. Mass extinction for their own comfort? Who thinks like that? Well, without their Gaia Colonel, they'll have a hard time doing that. So we're dealing with the same far zenith people who once lived on Earth. What else do you know about them? They were some of the most affluent and powerful people on Earth. They controlled almost every major resource, every industry. Gerard commands them. He's the one who decided to set up a base. The others, Eric, Tilda, Verbena, they resent his authority over them, but in the end they... Wait, Tilda, we've heard that name before, he right? Eric, he's the one I fought back in the Hades Proving Lab. He enjoys hurting people. Yeah, I know. How did you escape the Zeniths? Before the Hades Proving Lab, I never thought I'd get away from them. Even if I were to run, I'd never survive on my own in the wilds. 
Then I saw you. And I thought that maybe you could help me. So when the Zeniths pinpointed Eleuthia's location in the biomedical research facility, I saw an opportunity. You said you saw an opportunity to escape when you went to capture Eleuthia. What did you do, exactly? Whenever I was taken out on a mission to recover a subordinate function, only one of the Zeniths would go with me. The one the rebels killed, outside the facility. But Venus dead? How did they bypass her shield? I'm looking into it. But you were talking about your escape? Well, when it was time to use the Zenith's transmitter to send Eleuthia back to base, I also sent the encrypted transmission. Then I distracted Verbena long enough to seal myself in the ectogenic chamber, altering the facility's log so it appeared that there were only 236 containers. And the Gaia root kernel? I told them I could capture Luthia faster if I had it with me, and they believed me. Well done. You mentioned the Zenith set up a base here on Earth. Where is it? Off the coast, I think. Whenever I had to go on missions, I was transported inside of a Spectre drone. I couldn't see anything outside. But I did overhear the Zeniths talking about it once. They were discussing setting up a perimeter energy shield to repel the local fauna. I'm certain they have other security measures. Spectre patrols, machine wars. It, it must be impregnable. What's inside the base? Launch facilities, so they can shuttle back and forth to their ship in orbit. Plus, infrastructure to gather materials and fabricate anything they need. Are there more Zeniths than the ones you met? Uh, I'm not sure. I, I suppose there must be more of them in the base or back on the ship. For all I know, there could be more of them out in space. Are there survivors of the colony? You said the Zenith's colony in the Sirius system was destroyed. What happened? All I was ever told was that a natural disaster forced them to leave Sirius. I've speculated that it was an extrasolar object or a cataclysmic seismic event. Or maybe even an abnormally violent coronal mass ejection from Sirius A. The Zeniths never told you any details. They said the only thing that mattered was that they survived. First Earth, a thousand years ago, and then Sirius. Guess they survived old age, too. The Zeniths needed Elizabeth's gene print to access Zero Dawn facilities. So they made you. Trained you. And you went along with it? They told me I was born to interface with the Zero Dawn system. When we reached Earth, I pieced together what must have happened to Gaia and her subordinate functions. That's when I started to realize I wasn't meant to fix Gaia. That they must have made me so I could do what their remote extinction signal failed to do. Reboot Earth for their own benefit. So you know about the extinction signal? It was speculation, but the only logical conclusion why Gaia suddenly self-destructed after operating efficiently for centuries. Gaia would have only undertaken such a desperate course of action if it had detected a threat to life on Earth that was more dangerous than ceasing function altogether. I should have realized that she would also order the recreation of Elizabeth Sobek to rebuild her. Yeah, well... Surprise. You said you were born on the way to Earth. In an artificial womb, I'm guessing? The Zeniths had an ectogenic chamber aboard the ship. An updated version of the one you found me in. They must have used a stored sample of Elizabeth's DNA. I doubt Elizabeth would have let them take her DNA. Do you know how they got it? That wasn't part of the archive I was allowed to access. You said you spent years studying Wait, what training if interface. Elizabeth is actually alive? Was this archive you mentioned part of that? I know we had that cutscene at the end of Zero but Dawn, the but I was permitted to access. it's possible, right? Aristotle and Aspasia, the avatars of the archive, would assign me learning modules and evaluate my progress. Wait, those names. They were designed to be the virtual guides for the Apollo database before Ted Farrow purged it. The Zeniths have a copy. So it still exists. And you got to learn from it. Only what was deemed pertinent to the mission. 
If I requested information outside of my parameters, my tutors would deny it. To have all that knowledge just out of reach must have been frustrating. All right, I think that's enough for now. Do you want to come upstairs or so how long? What? How long what? You know, your, your, your plan. How long before Gaius fabricated a machine army to defeat the Zenus? How did you know optimal strategy, so? Well, I still have to get two more subordinate functions before Guy is powerful enough to absorb Hephaestus. What? You don't have Hephaestus already? Guy is still figuring out how to capture it. It's not confined to a single- To a single location, of course not! You didn't even know who the Zenus really are. You were supposed to be further along by now! Coming here was a mistake. They're gonna find me. They're gonna find this place and take me back. This was all for nothing! They're not going to find us. Guy is using Minerva to mask our location. What difference does it make? You're too far behind! We're never going to beat them! Everything! Everyone! I'm gonna die! Hey! Calm down. You're here now, right? This just got real so tense is there anything real you can do to help? Real quick. I have certain knowledge sets. And given your state of progress, expertise you probably lack. Geoengineering, of course. Computer science, physics, biology, chemistry. Okay. Well, see if you can do something with that. Talk to Gaia. I'll check on you later. How'd it go? Her injury's not that bad, but I think she regrets coming here. Feeling might be mutual. Hmm. I'll come back later and talk to her. See if I can learn anything. I should get the weapon fragment to Gaia. All right, everybody. Well, I think that's going to do it for today. We're going to have to let Gaia hang out until the next video. That was a lot of exposition, a lot of story, and uh, a lot of a lot of drama real quick. So, um, yeah, come back next time. Uh, be sure to subscribe if you're not already. Uh, thumbs up on the video helps a lot. Comment. Let me know what game you'd like to see come up next and enjoy the rest of your day. I'm going to take a break. But as always, I will see you in the next episode or next video tomorrow. Bye-bye. <laughs>